So guys, this is the moment you have all been waiting for. I can finally reveal my new horse. Just kidding, this isn't actually my new horse. Um, but it's a very cute <laughs> miniature Shetland that is on the yard. Can you imagine if I'd gone on about competing and then bought a miniature Shetland? But she's very cute. She's called Minnie and she's the yard owner's. But I just thought it'd be fun to just add her in here. Um, so yeah, this is Minnie. And next to Minnie in the stable, we have a new addition. So in my previous video, I'd already informed you that my new horse was a boy. And as you can see, he is also dapple gray. So this <laughs> new member of my herd is called Smokey, which is very fitting with his coloring. Now, a lot of people thought I was getting a bay. And so I wonder if you're quite surprised that I've gone for a another gray. And a lot of you were very off in the size of him. I'll tell you that later on. Um, but first I'll tell you his age. So he's actually six years of age. And this is Smokey. So Smokey is actually a 14 hand six year old Connemara pony. Um, he's a lot smaller than I was originally going to get. But I met him and I absolutely fell in love with him. And this pony, let me tell you, can jump. Now, Smokey is a bit of a project and he has got a long way to come. And our like relationship really needs to build. But he is an absolutely amazing horse. He has the loveliest nature. He's very inquisitive and very cheeky. Um, obviously he, he is only 14 hands um, and originally I was looking about 15, 16 hands but I just met him and I instantly fell in love with him and I have a love for ponies. So I just knew as soon as I set eyes on him that he was the horse for me. Now I have actually trialled Smokey for quite a while now and I'll show you some of the footage um, from me trialling him. So apologies for the quality because it isn't the best um, because it was taken on someone else's phone but this was me actually it was my third time riding Smokey I think or possibly my second um, and I took him into a jumping paddock so this was at his old owner's yard and this was the first time I'd sort of ridden him in the open and was just getting used to him and decided to pop a few little jumps. Now I have mainly got Smokey for jumping, as I said, he has got an amazing jump on him. He's done a little bit of competing with his previous owner, but he is um, quite green um, and needs bringing on before I do start competing him properly. But this was our, actually our very first jump. Um, and as you can see, I was completely too forward in the seat. I was really not used to the pony strides and his little pop because I was so used to riding Chili. So it was very, very strange jumping him initially. Um, but we did get there and I did really enjoy jumping him. And from that moment, I just decided that I loved him to pieces. So this video is actually from the second day that he was with us. And it was me preparing for our first ever ride. Smokey has amazing manners in the stable. He really is a lovely little horse to be around and that was the main reason that I fell in love with him. He has very good manners. He's kind of easy to do on the ground. He's not the easiest in terms of riding like I say he's a project he needs bringing on but that's what I wanted. I wanted a bit of a challenge and a horse that I can look to do riding club with and compete with and take out cross country. He's an all-rounder who will let me do everything and that's what I really wanted. Um, so this being our first ever ride, um, I first obviously walked him to the arena and then I actually walked him around the arena for a few minutes just for him to settle in, get used to everything, have a look at everything, have a few shies. Um, he can be a little bit spooky, but obviously he's a baby, he's getting used to everything. And it's a brand new yard for him and this was literally the second day after he'd been um so you know he was still settling in and he was just getting a lot of reassurance from myself and then i climbed on board and thought we'd start very slowly um, I initially just thought, you know, we'll just do a bit of walk and trot and get him listening um, get, see what he was like under saddle because previously when I'd ridden him he was good as gold but he was in a situation that he was used to, you know, he'd been in that other arena you know hundreds of times so to be in a brand new yard um 
and to be so young and he is quite forward he's quite a forward horse and um, it was going to take a little bit of getting used to for myself but he was absolutely fantastic the first time I rode him he had a look at a few things but he wasn't spooky really at all I was so proud of him uh, we really just did walk and trot we did do a little bit of canter his canter work does need work um, his flat work needs more work than his jumping like if you point him at a jump he will go over it really well um, he is definitely a natural jumper and especially cross country he is very bold cross country but his flat work does need more um, you know developing because he's young um, so his canter transitions at the minute he's a bit running into it um, but actually I've been working on that this week with him because I have had him a week now and he is like getting a lot better with those so obviously this is just the very beginning with Smokey we do have a lot of like work to do on our groundwork but we have started doing some little jumps and um, he is capable of much bigger jumps but just for now I'm keeping them small but in the future we're going to be going out hacking because I can now on this yard we're going to be doing cross country because there is a little cross country course on the yard and um, we are going to be doing a lot more jumping and as I say I am joining riding club so I will be starting to compete with him as well so I'm really excited to bring you guys along on our journey and to see what we achieve together so anyway guys I hope you like Smokey don't forget to follow me on Instagram at little pet channel and don't forget to subscribe and turn on that bell icon so you get a notification every time I post and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye guys!